Top 10 Most Corrupt Politicians in the World. Before we begin with the video, just make sure that you like it and subscribe to our channel. Turn on the bell notifications so that you'll never miss any amazing videos from us. 1. Mohamed Suharto, Former President of Indonesia Mystery man that ranks number one at the listing of the most corrupt politicians on the world is Mohamed Suharto, seeing as because he's managed to get to the top of the presidency with a glittery searching cherry of being capable of taking extra than his joint mission friends. The prize is that he is really worse in the inefficient fee of infamous presidential fraud. Surely it merits a campaign or game show of its very own wherein the winner who can embezzle the most out of a country wins and Mohamed Suharto seems to have won it big all through his 30 years presidential period of office inside the country's highest seat. During this time of presidency, it would have manifestly given Mr. Suharto greater than sufficient time to take some billions for himself and to genuinely no marvel that he surpassed the fraudulent quantity of the relaxations, achieving a magnificent figure of 15 to 35 billion dollars in stone bloodless hard assets and Swiss money owed that have been perfectly present in terms of its lifestyles. But all over again in which money talks, the corrupt ears will concentrate very carefully and so it has been pulled off. 2. Ferdinand Marcos former president of the Philippines. As part of the three musketeers and why we name them musketeers is due to their capability to place on a reputable and responsible look to their public of being first-rate leaders of the Philippine until that mask comes out and the robbers are found out. It's no longer beside the point to name them mask robbers either. And with this mask, they sure did create a phantom in their very personal opera. Yes, You've guessed it, Ferdinand Marcos is a mystery man too inside the three-man joint undertaking of billions to be predicted among each other on the subject of their fraudulent ex. 3. Mobutu Sese Seko, former president of Zaire From this factor on, the story of fraudulent ex grows to be interlinked with every underneath this rank, because it seems that the following two scores beneath Mobutu Sese Seko have been interlinked and shown as accomplices that have been concerned in what expected to be a $50 billion three-man scorn from all three of the countries that told that those men constitute, which includes Zaire, Philippines, and Indonesia. This is, in reality, the sum identical to every year price range of the West. 4. Slobodan Milosevic, former president of Yugoslavia In terms of fraud, one ought to ask oneself what's the restrictions that any individual may want to attain in terms of the amount of cash they might take from the states without being stuck and how long they can pull this off. There should be a certain genius at the back of this, as it isn't as smooth as mugging a homeless guy on the road of his remaining penny to try from something as large as a whole country. Mr. Milosevic, however, has long gone past just money fraud in this case and has been convicted in keeping with BBC's document of a few high-profile killings and being the pinnacle at the back of assassinations attacks, killing of witness or folks who were brave enough to bring him to justice. 5. Sani Abacha, former president of Nigeria Nigeria, because it stands to the world, is automatically classed as the struggle-torn country. And pretty frankly, who ought to blame the arena for questioning so lowly of them while civil conflicts appears to be so famous? The locals are relatively getting better at it. War-torn countries require a front-runner that can turn a whole kingdom around, command operations of battle, and in fact, win at it to guard the call and people of a country. Not each chief appointed and elected into presidency or parliament or a high-profile functions in a rustic seas the real desires of the humans and meets demands of what desires to be changed urgently for the better of those protesting legally for it. 6. Jean-Claude Duvalier, former president of Haiti We all recognize that movement megastar Jean-Claude Van Damme has been the awful boy dominating the action genre of Hollywood since the 80s, and there was only considered one of him. Jean-Claude Duvalier, however, manifestly tried to imitate this actor in truth because of his first call being identical and very humorously couldn't come close it appears. Some human beings in power are regarded to be waving the flag of a commonplace fashion that having a president title surely method, I own the whole thing and all of us in a rustic. And this is where an abuse of power gets to the excellent in their morality and ideas and essentially everything else turn as soon as someone comes into full power and manage a country. It wouldn't be very long until their power is taken to go where everything is now swindled by way of their intimidating and authority to certain figure. Duvalier is one of the most corrupt politicians ever. 7. Alberto Fujimori, former president of Peru A funny call this man has but a smart attitude, cleverer than all of his different corrupt pals to date. 
as the quantity in his corruption's rating fee is alternatively impressive. Corrupt presidents, a number of the maximum corrupt politicians, isn't an unusual issue. In this example, it's just that a number of them are a little bit greater shrewd in their corruption parades that they were able to milk more out of the country than the rest earlier that they have been brought to criminal justice. Alberto Fujimori is of Asian descent, which generally method discipline, sharp-witted and wise as well as mentally sharp for the reasons that they have Asian blood, which is known to the sector for his or her interest in the element type of style in the entirety they are saying, and do which guarantees order and precisions in most cases. 8. Pavlo Lazarenko, former Prime Minister of Ukraine the most common pattern among every one of these corrupt groups of people is that each one sets of fashions that is going better than the previous corrupted individuals. It's strangely nearly like the oppositions who can scouse borrow the maximum amount of cash or be the kingdom's maximum corrupted politicians. It is instead wonderful and stupid as nicely. What some individuals might do advantage a place in the records of the arena but for the wrong motives. Pavlo, however, seems to have executed extremely properly his illegal and unlawful acts all through the length of his time as just a mere prime minister. Now, not even the president in this example. Still, regardless of being the prime minister, it was in Pavlos' plan to apply the president as a defense or divert all interests from him, so that he ought to preserve to move on his quest for fraudulent activities which might be to the predicted corruption's price of $200 million which seems to have mysteriously disappeared and later revealed that part of it has been used to signal a $10 billion deal abusing office rights and phrases. 9. Arnoldo Aleman, former president of Nicaragua Being the 81st president of any country, needs to be a big honor to every man. No matter how many presidents have had before you, the president title genuinely matter the head of the nation, leader of the whole country, world popularity, being a reliable part of a rustic history, and so forth. However, some humans appear to no longer understand the novelty, significance, honor, and integrity of their presidential titles and generally tends to abuse the privileges passed on to them with the aid of the state. Presidents are below oath too, However, for some people like Arnoldo, all this doesn't mean anything as having all the world's wealthy that exceeds his pay which was sure to spark an arose suspicion. 10. Joseph Estrada, former president of the Philippines At the very starting earlier than he has been officially elected as president, he used the art of manipulations to create a land of make-believe via using the poverty occasions of the general public of the Philippines toward them in an effort to successful to useful resource in his marketing campaign and manifesto which manifestly helped in his elections process as he comes what may anticipate that. It's the best way to advantage the respect and voting choose of the decreased magnificence first in order that the better society individuals could apprehend him as being a true president this is there to really improve the well-being of the human beings starting from the lowest to the best in society. To his disgrace, there was obviously an ulterior cause at the back of his charade that he managed to put on as he received the votes and he has been elected as president of the Philippines over the years. Let's share your thoughts in the comment sections. Follow us for more updates and thank you for watching.